If you're asked to graph the equation y equals 4 thirds x plus 3, here's how you do it. We're going to use slope-intercept form to graph this equation. You could use a table of values. I find that slope-intercept form is a lot easier, especially since we have this fraction here in our equation. So y equals mx plus b. b is the y-intercept, and that is 3. So what we do, we go to the y-axis, we go to 3, and that's where our line is going to cross the y axis. That's the y-intercept. Then the slope, m, that's 4 thirds. And we can think of this as rise over run. We rise 4, we run 3 to the right. So we go to our y-intercept, we rise 1, 2, 3, 4, and we run 1, 2, 3. And there's our line. Let's take another point here. Let's go 1, 2, 3, 4, and 1, 2, 3. And you can see that's on our line. Let's do another point, but this time we're going to go the opposite direction. We're going to go down 1, 2, 3, 4, and to the left 1, 2, 3. And that's also on our line. Let's put a line through this. And then let's get rid of this since it's not on our graph paper there. Put arrows to show it goes to infinity. And that's the graph for y equals 4 thirds x plus 3. Note we could have used a table of values, but slope-intercept form is pretty quick. This is Dr. V. Thanks for watching.